Hey everybody, this is the slightest review. So Marvel's Runaways was completely scrubbed from both Hulu and Disney Plus. And it was scrubbed with no warning. That's really, really messed up. It was a decent Marvel show. It wasn't perfect, but it was a whole lot better than most of the Disney Plus Marvel shows that's been coming out. But the worst part about it is, is that they didn't even let nobody know they was removing this. They had a huge list of stuff they was getting rid of on Disney Plus and Hulu um, a couple of days ago. But this show was never on the list. And I'm just kind of like, what in the world, man? Just because they don't want to pay residuals and stuff? It's like, if you're gonna... Like, this is the thing about, like, the reason why I had to re-get, like, Disney Plus and Hulu. When I found out some shows that I liked were, like, getting, like, you know, scrubbed, I'm like, crap, dude, I got hurt when I watch it. But I only had, like, four days to watch stuff. Because they only let people know a few days in advance. And then they let other people... Then other shows were constantly being added to the list. And... Yeah, I didn't even have time to re-watch this show, and I really wanted to re-watch this show. And all I can think about is, like, I blame David Zasloff. See, he was the one who originally started this crap. When he started deleting stuff permanently from his, um, his streaming app. And it was, like, original shows, not carry-on shows from, like, other, like, places and stuff. Then once that started going around... Disney started getting greedy. They were like, hey, look, we ain't got to pay residuals to, like, writers and actors and, like, directors and stuff. This is some bull crap, man. I swear to God, it is some bull crap. It's like, and this is one of their original shows, and it's part of, like, the Marvel Universe. You know how I mean crappy... Marvel movies and shows they still have on Disney Plus. You know how I many Disney Plus original shows that are crap that they still have on there that have been canceled for a good while? You know how I many classic other stuff they brought in from like other networks that is crap and they still have on there? Like, I don't get this crap. And you can't buy it nowhere like on like DVD because it's not on DVD. And you, you literally can't even watch this, like, nowhere. And I mean nowhere and stuff. Alrighty. Well, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.